I'd like to wish everyone who is celebrating a happy Easter. Um, anyone who's not, I hope you're enjoying a lot of chocolate eggs. And if you're in the UK, happy bank holiday as well. I hope you enjoy this video and I'll catch you soon, guys. Okay, guys, these are our four blueberry plants. We ordered these from Thompson & Morgan. They arrived earlier this week. They're only about nine cents into pot. But if I take one off now, I'm going to do a quick show. Um, so, I don't know if you can see how well you can see. They've got some good growth on them already. All of them, I've just kept them moist in the house for now. Um, just while we were, before we got them down here. So they're all moist. The variety is Duke, Blueberry Duke. Um, so we've got four of them. Blueberries are self-pollinating, but from what I've read, you you get more fruit if you've got more than um, one plant. They'll um, cross-pollinate with each other then. So we've got four, and that should provide us with a decent amount of blueberries, really. Now, Before we plant the blueberries, we need to make sure the soil is right. They need ericaceous um, compost, which is an acidic-based. Blueberries love acidic soil. So we've bought some um, ericaceous compost. So what we'll do is I'll take it down, we'll dig the holes, and I'll show you how I'm going to plant these up. Um, and we'll go from there. Okay, folks. We've planted two of them already. We've got one here and one there. We're going to plant two in the middle. So the first thing we need to do we need to get rid of some of this soil. And like I said, we need the ericaceous um, soil, which is acidic, for the blueberries. So the first thing we're going to do is dig two holes ready for these. And we'll put one there and one there. Then, folks so now we've got the two holes we need to put some I'm gonna put some feed in them um, just so that when the roots get down there's a bit of feed in it and it helps the soil around it um, be a bit more acidic that's the feed we're using so all I'm gonna do is put my hand full in each hole bring it around and just mix it in Big worm. Same as the other one. Just a handful. Sprinkle it around. If you find any sticks or anything, just get rid of them. Spread this out and give it a good mix. Break any lumps that may be in there. And again, we're going to put another handful in. That's it.
remember where to put the plant. So what we want to do, we want to encourage the roots <laughs> down a bit. We've got some mycorrhizal fungi just to help the roots out. So a little bit in there. So it's the same, exactly the same again. So that's the, uh, the blueberries planted, hopefully that'll be enough to get them going really. Um, one thing to remember is try and water them with rain water rather than um, tap water or water that comes from source. Just because it adds up the alkalines into the soil and it can kill them off so try and over water with rain water. But that's it, what I'll do is I'll just tidy up now, label them up and off we go and hopefully have some nice blueberries.